right, friends, how's it going? Today we're going to be playing The Sims 4, and I'm going to absolutely destroy this cottage living pack. I say that with sarcastic air quotes because last time I tried industrializing the uh, chicken industry, and we're going to try and push that even further this time. And I think the first thing to capitalize on is the man eating cow plant industry because there's a gap in the market. I can sense it. Wait, they're all failing to germinate. <laughs> God damn it. And wait, what is this? There's a fox? What? Are you talking about the silver fox known as Jim Pickens? Or what are you saying? There's no way he can get into my chickens. They're <laughs> in jail, essentially. Plus, I lit the last one on fire, so surely that got around and no foxes would dare. All right, let's try and space these out a bit more. Give them a bit of room to grow. Water with tears. Yeah, why not? Make that one extra evil. Oh, great. It's raining. Now I don't even have to do any work right on cue. Fantastic. You see, I want like an industrial farm, but part of that is having employees. Can I hire, like, a gardener to take care of my entire farm? All right, schedule gardening service. Let's try that. What? White Hen is thinking of leaving soon. I don't think White Hen understands the situation they're in. How do they plan on leaving? Oh, no, now Brown Hen is thinking about it, too. Imagine being in a prison and just going, I think I'll leave soon. <laughs> if only it were that simple. Then I wouldn't just be committing crimes in video games. Oh, something tells me I'm going to be hearing a lot of this sad tune they're trying to guilt me with. Sorry, kids, you won't get any gifts this year. Santa Claus is cleaning the chickens. Spotted Cow has been unhappy for a while due to inadequate care. However, Spotted Cow will stay if the Turgs? Since when are we the Turgs? Can provide food, cleaning, and attention. The basics of a good life. Hey, my people don't get food, cleaning, or attention, and they're fine. Well, I don't know if this is fine. <laughs> he just drops it on the floor. Okay, I can understand why they want to leave. They look so dirty, they actually look radioactive. Well, look, that's what you get for being a ch 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 chicken In the words of the great Tommy Wiseau, cheep, 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 cheep. Stop peeing on the chicken, Santa. <laughs> God, it sounds like the worst children's book ever. <laughs> All right, you, like, I know you're not in my family, but could you take care of the cow, please? Can I just add you to my family? I probably can. I think you like Jim. Asked to join household. Oh, you really like Jim. <laughs> God, some people really don't mind being trapped inside a pen do they? The cows and chickens could learn a lot from you. At least she's having a good time. I don't know how, but she is. She's definitely got a positive outlook on life. Like, the glass isn't half full, it's overflowing. <laughs> and realistically, it's overflowing with shit, but she's happy with that. Yeah, yips. Oh, she's like, oh, why not? Yes, I'd love to officially be part of this household so I can be a willing prisoner. Stockholm Syndrome, here I come. There you go, welcome to the family. Whoa. Now take care of the cow. Can't be done while animal is in shed. <laughs> she cannot woo with Jim. Hold on, let's take away its last right to sleep, <laughs> and then we'll go in and woohoo. Woohoo! Animal cruelty always puts you in the mood, right? This poor cow is getting absolutely neglected. <laughs> I think he actually stinks less than the rest of them, though. However, he is still dirty, unhappy, and starving. Attention is okay, though. Not really sure how unhappy plus dirty plus starving equals okay. Okay, brown hen is thinking of leaving. For feck's sake, I'm gonna have to try and get parts, because you can upgrade these by going to this, which is grayed out. Okay, Santa's in a great mood. Let's see if we can do it with him. Actions, upgrade, coop auto feeder. Yeah, that's what we need. What the hell is the Finchwick Fair? I guess I'll go. I'll be there in a moment. <laughs> Sorry, hold on, my animals are screaming abuse. What are you doing? You are a feckin' idiot, Jim. Honestly, why are you eating Santa's- Oh my god. You know sushi kills. You've killed so many people with this. Ah, <sighs> he's an idiot. Ah, uh, what can you say? Apple doesn't fall far from the tree, I suppose. The fox is in here somehow. I don't know how the fox got inside the house. He smells something good. That's the puffer fish. You can take some if you want. Hold on, plead. <laughs> Come on, dude. <laughs> I have Stockholm Syndrome. Real bad. Plus, he doesn't even look dead. Look, he's checking the pipes under the counter. Oh, for feck's sake. Well, this just became a rescue mission. Oh, look at a fancy urn. Where have you been getting these fertilizers from, Santa? <laughs> Are these self-made or, or what? All right, I know Jim had a load of death flowers on him or whatever, but this is an issue because I think it was in his inventory, unless it transfers to here. <gasps> yes! Okay, great. Oh, all the urns got put into the family inventory as well. <gasps> there it is. The Book of Life. Okay, fantastic. He had that in his inventory. I only had one copy. I need to make more of these. The Secret to uh, Everlasting Life. And he only wrote one. It was like, I'll get around to the rest later. <laughs> Meanwhile, he's holding four copies of Reel Her In. 
<laughs> a romantic fisherman novel. Wait, I can create a copy of that for 20 bucks? Does the copy work? <laughs> I guess you could just photocopy it, right? What's the point writing another one? Okay, so like all things in life, I half-assed the book. Apparently you have to do it before they die. You gotta capture their essence or whatever. But I have all the ingredients and I definitely didn't cheat to make Turk an excellent cook so he can actually cook ambrosia. You cheated, I didn't. What? You, 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 I, mm, you're bad. <laughs> All right, Turk, I know you're not feeling great. Why the hell is the Grim Reaper serving up drinks in my living room? All right, you know what? Ignoring that, I gotta go to the shop and pick up one last ingredient for this amazing ambrosia. Unfortunately, I think I have amnosia because I'm not sure exactly where I can find it. I think it's here. Oh, look, there's the pit where I made the two. Ooh, there's another Jim Pickens there? Maybe I have to sacrifice that one to bring back the new one. But yeah, that's the fighting pit where I made the two Santas fight each other and then the winner got to eat the other. Uh, hey, I need your life essence. Sul Sul. Yes, Sul Sul to you too. Follow me. Buy bait. Angel fish. Oh my god, that's so cheap too. G give me loads of them. I need loads. This is so weird. Look at him. He's just going about his day. He's an exact clone. All right, can I cook it now? I should be able to. There we go. That's what we need. Just a little fry up to bring him back from the dead, you know? All right, there's the meal. Now I just need Jim to come out and eat it. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Okay, eat it. Eat the ambrosia. <laughs> it's not doing anything. Okay, there he goes. Goodbye. <laughs> He's going like, hello, I am also Jim. Good to meet you. Is this ambrosia just not after working or what? Oh, the Grim Reaper's here. Ah, oh, he's still eating the ambrosia. Okay. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. It's Jim Pickens and Ghost Jim Pickens just having a chat while the Grim Reaper and Turg talk away between themselves about baseball. <laughs> Why are there so many sad sounds from all the chickens leaving? And I don't think any sad sound played when Jim died. Ah, here we go. He's coming back. I've sensed a disturbance in the universe. There we go. He's back. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, shove the Grim Reaper. That'll show him. He's getting sad. <laughs> all right, back to what I was doing. I don't know whether to sacrifice the other Jim or not. Like, I do need the potion of youth, which I think you can get from absorbing their life essence by feeding them to this plant. I'm pretty sure you can but then again i could do that with anyone i'll have a think about it i'll see how the clone acts while he's here but i need something to differentiate him like he's he's close enough to a clone he's he's very close oh okay i was wondering why he wouldn't change appearance it's because the other jim is in the bath but in fairness you've seen it all before like it's you i feel like jim wouldn't even mind like he, he wouldn't be surprised that a clone of him showed up somehow with all the weird stuff he's done all right look could you just wear the hot dog helmet all the time that would really help me out Working out, hot dog helmet. Going to sleep, hot dog helmet. At a party, hot dog helmet. In the pool, hot dog helmet. Feeling too hot, too bad, hot dog helmet. Feeling cold, better wrap up in that hot dog helmet. All right, that should make it clearer who's the clone and not. The only thing he's holding is this children's guitar. Okay, I came out to check on the cow and why is the real Jim naked just standing with the cow? He's like, hey, the cow is naked. I just got naked too, so he'd be more comfortable. What is he doing? Shower in the rain. This isn't shower. Showering. <laughs> Who goes into the shower and just stands there idling? Wait, his gravestone's still there, so I still get to keep my own urn? That's a little weird. <laughs> At least it's a nice one. <laughs> we'll keep it in there in the kitchen. Remind me of better times when I was dead. <laughs> right, we definitely have to expand this little area of the farm. It's way too homely. Oh, lovely flowers in the way? No, they're not gonna stay then. I'm here to make money, not look like a nice farm. There we go, all planted for the crop season. This is looking like a nice farm, other than all the animal abuse. My moat is still staying well protected. The crocodile's on the lookout for the foxes. I feel like buying crocodiles to stop the foxes is just gonna escalate to having a crocodile infestation instead of a fox infestation. In which case, I don't know what I would have to do next. Oh, hey, clone Jim. I don't know why I didn't get you to plant all the feckin' plants. This is a terrifying image. Like, I don't even know why. It's just very scary. Oh, he's making his own fertilizer as well. <laughs> the hell is that for? Festival of youth. I have no one young here. Everyone is old. <laughs> Damn kids and their festivals. I'm just not used to hearing happy sounds. <laughs> it's usually all sad ones and chickens threatening to leave and then realizing they can't. All right, it's time to collect the eggs before they revolt and start chucking them at me. Hey, I got a special gift for you because you're such a good neighbor and I appreciate your kindness. But who is that? Sorry, I'm getting so many like abused chicken alerts. I didn't see it come up. I don't know where he went. He could be anywhere on the farm. He's most likely dead. <laughs> he probably went 
went into the Crocs, and I don't mean like as a fashion statement, like literally into the moat. Play in water? You can play in the crocodile moat? Okay, this seems like a terrible idea. <laughs> Where's the crocodile? Oh, there it is. No, hot dog Jim, get away from there. And now she's going to sleep right next to the moat. Okay, she's playing with fire, or maybe she just wants to die. I don't understand. <laughs> okay, how many eggs did I get from that? Holy shit, that's so many eggs. <laughs> Wait, 21 hours until spoiled? How the hell am I supposed to eat 77 eggs? Oh, what is happening now? My chickens are being attacked. Good thing they're just the distraction chickens. <laughs> the real gold mine is in the back. Wait, oh my god, I thought that was another Jim Pickens for a second. I got scared. They must all think he's mad. Like, I just saw you earlier. Oh, no, no, no. That was Jim Pickens. I'm Jim Pickens. I wear a hot dog outfit. <laughs> they're like, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> and then the real one walks out. It's good. He's fulfilling my social duties while the real one is asleep on the floor. All right, I think we got to play the waiting game for a bit and just wait for these to grow so I can feed my neighbors to them and then absorb their essence. Okay, bad news. I was fast forwarding time and I forgot that, well, you know, I'm neglecting my sims and, well, Grace died. I do have some extra stuff that I could bring her back with, but eh. I don't really understand how, but some of my stuff are burnt to a crisp as well and I don't know what happened. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, that's a cheery sound. What was that for? Grace is dying from starvation. Okay. What the hell have you been eating? Oh, I think you've blocked your path in to eat more. I hope you haven't been cooking the chickens because you've no way of getting supplies. Wait, white hen has returned after a grand chicken adventure. Better treat them right this time or they might not come back. How are they even going to get back in? How did they get out? Look at them marching back like some sort of chicken run sequel. Except they're trying to get into captivity. Okay, they just appear inside. Interesting. All the eggs in my inventory are spoiled. I'm starting to think the industrial chicken industry doesn't work too well in The Sims 4. You gotta act fast, you know? Now the crops on the other hand, that's another story. They're going great. Oh, I just went outside to water all the crops and it started raining. For some reason, the gardener doesn't seem to be coming. Like, all the crops are dying. I might have to look for alternative measures and I've got just the idea. Hire a service. And no, not another gardener because I already have one scheduled apparently and it's not showing up. I'm going to adopt a child and they can take care of the garden. Uh, too young, too young, too young. Uh, do you have any, like, elder who just wants to be adopted? You look sure for your age. <laughs> I'll hire you. <laughs> the adoption agency is like, what do you mean hire? <laughs> All right, the orphanage would like to introduce the gardener. There we go. Oh, and the gardener just showed up. Well, that's unfortunate timing. I don't need you anymore. <laughs> He's like hugging her goodbye. The adoption agency hasn't even left. And I've placed the child on a rock in the middle of the crocodile pit. All right, well, at least I gave her her phone. Damn millennials. She'll play some Candy Crush. She'll be fine. I like how the gardener waited for a torrential storm to show up so he doesn't have to do any watering. Crafty bastard. I'll put you on the island next. In fact, there you go. Now you're both on the island. And now you look like the cruel one. You've taken this child onto the island, you weirdo. <laughs> That little tune that played, it was like the realization that they weren't alone. Hot dog Jim is sound asleep and real Jim is cleaning and looking out the window at the crocodile pit. I'm going to be bankrupt for before long. I just had to pay 33,000 on bills. Maybe I could put the chickens in like a giant wheel and have them run to generate power. He's having the time of his life on the farm. That's the main thing. Like from this angle, it looks great. It's just some old man having a blast splashing in a pond with a rainbow in the background. But then if you look literally anywhere else on the farm, it's an absolute absolute nightmare. Oh, I better move her headstone to the graveyard and better feed the cows. I'm doing a pretty good job on keeping on top of this farm, I gotta say. Hey there, neighbor, do I hear the sizzle of something broken in there? Oh, you want to help? Yeah, come on in. You better be here to actually help because I visited the neighboring farms last time and lit them all on fire. I'm not used to neighbors coming in helping. She's probably just trying to get in my good graces, to be fair. Oh, also, I can remove you from the family. You're no longer needed. Have fun on the island. <laughs> She's been greeted by the clones. Why do you look like Luigi? What's going on here? Are you some oh, you're an inspector. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm sure you'll find everything is uh, fine on the farm. Oh, okay. No, it's not like a regulatory thing. She'll just tell me if there are any issues. Okay, I'll pay for the, the test then. Tell me if there are any issues. I'm sure there are not. And don't speak to the clone. He doesn't like being spoken to. Well done. Looks like this household is in compliance of all active neighborhood action plans. You'll see a reduction in your next round of bills. Fantastic. I don't know what uh, about this show's commitment to the neighborhood, but I'm glad you like it. Oh! <gasps> 
<gasps> my first one is done. Wait, Crumple Bottom? Do I know you? I don't really want to visit anyone right now. Why don't you come here? <laughs> I've got a surprise for you. Oh, there's another one. They're popping up everywhere now. All right, who do I want to invite over that I just don't like? All right, all his enemies are dead. I guess just random people then. The firefighter. I killed another firefighter last time, so may as well get rid of the entire firefighting service. Oh, wait, they're showing up now? I thought I could set a time. It's 5 a.m. Wait, the cows don't even want to eat yet. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Okay, you can you can go home, everyone. I, I'll let you know when the, the plants are hungry. I mean, when the, the, the cake is ready. Oh my god, they're all morphing into one so they can share an Uber. Okay, now you're talking. Here we go. <laughs> this is exactly what we need. All right, let's call up those people again. And you know what? We'll say it was uh, Santa Claus's party. Then all the blame can be pinned on him. All right, the cake is ready. See, I promised you. You can eat that now. Oh, here we go. Yes. Oh my god, that was so sudden. Jesus Christ. Holy crap. It's such a violent pull. Oh, there goes the one in the back. Goodbye. <laughs> she just strolls away from this. <gasps> she made it out. Wait, do they not die? Have they survived through this? Oh, the one in the back is good too. Oh god. But do I get their juice? Oh, there she goes another one. <laughs> okay, this might be the greatest plan I've ever had in The Sims 4. Oh, there goes another one. They're not very smart, are they? Like, they've seen other people suffering and they just do it anyway. Oh, look at the little bunny. That's so cute. And not that you plants aren't cute too. Like, that's, that's utterly beautiful. She's giving out to it. Like, do not eat me again. I can see someone getting eaten in the background over there. All right, let me drink your juices. You can blame Santa, by the way. Leave him the bad review because I'm just here to drink some milk. I'm also just a guest. Milk all of the cows. This isn't what you had in mind when you thought you'd have cows and you'd milk them on the farm, is it, Jim? Some farmers grow plants, some raise cattle. I chose both at the same time. Oh, and there goes another one. <laughs> Jesus, all of them were fed now. That was the last one. He really is a good farm hand. He's taking care of all of them. All right, I got all your juices. Uh, you can all go home now. Goodbye. Wait, I would like to adult now? Who are you? You look like an adult. What? You'll always be my baby. <laughs> yeah, sure. I don't know who you are. Ashlyn Rose. I have no idea who you are. You are an adult, aren't you? A teen. Okay. I have no idea who you are, though. All right, what have we got here? That's <laughs> coffee. That's not from the cow. We got essence of happiness. Yeah, let's drink that. I thought I'd get potions of youth, but this works too. Oh, sorry. I can't be happy right now. I'm sleeping on the floor. There we go. Nice potion of happiness. Potion of playfulness. Yeah, let's, let's double down. I'm not sure if doctors would recommend this, but oh well. He's having a great time. And the crops are doing great. The cow has uh, left, <laughs> but the chickens are doing fine. And the hatchable eggs are automatically going in and hatching. So they're kind of refilling as they leave. And the island is doing great too. All in all, a very successful day on the farm. I hope you enjoyed the video, folks. If you haven't already, consider subscribing. Would love to have you around the farm. Visit anytime. Uh, thank you all for watching. Hugely appreciate it. And I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.